A northwest side home heavily damaged this afternoon by an intense fire. It happened in the 1000 block of Cloverbrook Street. Tim Gerber live on the scene. Tim, I understand the flames so hot that some surrounding homes also damaged. Well, that's right. Let me step out of the way so you can see what we're talking about here. The roof is completely burned off of a large section of the home where that fire actually started. And then you see the house right next door, also slightly charred by the heat coming off of this very intense house fire. According to San Antonio Fire Chief Charles Hood, the fire was reported just before 4 o'clock this afternoon. The homeowner said he noticed a burning smell in the home and heard some pops and crackling noises coming from the attic shortly before that fire erupted. By the time firefighters arrived on scene, the home was nearly fully engulfed in flames. The the homeowner and his wife managed to escape with two dogs without any injuries. They were searching for a cat that lived in the home, and I was just told that they did find that cat, and the cat is alive. Chief Hood said his crews did an excellent job today, stopping the flames from spreading to the homes on either side. What we did do was take a crew inside with a hand line, got up in the attic to make sure that there was no extension to it, so it remained on the outside. There was also some flame impingement to the house over here to the north, not as bad, but we were able to get inside and make sure that it the inside of that house is protected. Another big factor out here this afternoon was the heat. Extra crews had to respond to the fire so they could rotate firefighters in and out of the burning home just to avoid any heat-related injuries, something they always do when the summer heat hits. Right now, no cause for the fire, but since it did start in the attic, Chief Hood was speculating that it might have been electrical in nature. Reporting live tonight on the northwest side, Tim Gerber, KSAT 12 News.